Urban Nature Guy here on a cool Montana winter day. And you know, I'm getting a lot of phone calls this year about a lot of different animals that people aren't used to seeing this time of year. And one of those, the Canada Goose. And I'm telling you, if you've been out in the evening, usually when it start, the sun's starting to set or in the early morning when the sun's rising, you've seen thousands of geese flying by. You know it's a Canada Goose because of that V pattern. They do that for aerodynamics. You can see just how beautiful they are when they fly. But there has been an increased number because they're changing their migration patterns. Now, there's two things I want to talk about. First of all, why are their patterns changing? There's a couple reasons. One is it's a little bit warmer the farther north you go. So their southern migration isn't as far as it used to be. So right now, Billings, the Montana, southern Montana area, it's kind of right in that ripe zone where it's a perfect place for these geese to migrate to because they're able to get food year round. Number two is farming practices have changed a bit. So because of harvesting being a little bit later, there's a lot more waste grain in the fields a lot later, giving the geese a food source later in the year. And so that's why when you drive by those farm fields or those big open fields, you'll see sometimes hundreds if not thousands of geese in those fields, even though there's not water anywhere around, it's because they're, heart, they're eating that leftover harvest grain. And three, changing hunting patterns. As, as there's changes in the hunting uh, time frames and dates, sometimes that can affect the migration patterns of these birds. Believe it or not, they do know when these hunting changes occur. It's pretty amazing. But the other thing about these geese that I just love is, of course, first of all, how big they are, how they fly, they're just spectacular, but how they can survive in this water when it's so cold. Now, behind me, you can see there's geese, there's ducks, there's even some coot out there. But the amazing thing is they've got just a much more effective blood flow system, especially in their feet, than we as humans have. So they can literally be in this water all day and not worry one bit about frostbite in those webbed toes of theirs. In fact, you see them walking on the snow and they could care less how cold it is. Pretty amazing. But keep your eyes open. Right now, this is the time of year, like I said, sunset, sunrise, look for those geese. You're going to see them flying in sometimes flocks of 100 geese. And the cool thing is it can be day or night. There's nothing more weird than being outside in pitch dark and hearing a flock of geese honking over your head knowing it's pitch dark outside. How cool is that? Maybe they're following the stars. Who knows? Guys, until next time, I'm Jeff the Nature Guy here at one of the great parks here in Billings. We'll see you soon.